Okay, listen. I know that I've been gone for a few weeks. No, it's time to come back. <laughs> Okay, so obviously updated my life, I still haven't found a car mount. So if anyone wants to just like send me a link, actually don't send me a link, I'm just being lazy. I can find one online, I can order it myself. I'm a grown adult, it's fine. But the thing that I wanted to talk to you about, first of all, is that I'm sorry I've been gone. Um, I've just been very busy with work. Okay, you know what, there's no excuse. I should have been here and I wasn't. But let me catch you up on the things that have been going on in my life over the last couple weeks. Well, um, took some quality photos for my Instagram. I went to the store, got these, <laughs> and these. It is so cold, it's still winter in Canada. Um, but I'm trying to recreate this. I've been wanting to recreate a celebrity photo for a while and I saw that one pop up yesterday and I knew that there was a store near my house that sold this for very very cheap um, so I went and got some and then got a burrito because that is the closest thing to a baby in my life. I had the phone like in my in the burrito so I could like look like check it for reference with the pose and then I okay the blue is already water damaged you've seen that in my last video but I smashed my entire screen i haven't done that in years so i needed to go get my phone fixed anyway so i guess this is just like a reason what time okay i'm making a mess i'm getting rowdy it is 8 a.m it is 8 40. okay i gotta go to work <laughs> Bye. to see the full photo um go on my instagram and then go throw me a follow if you like you know like if you just feel like it or just like wanna support local artists then Go follow me on Instagram, link is in the bio. <laughs> you know, I love me a good themed party. So my friends and I decided on the theme of emo, which ended up working out pretty well. We've had a denim party. We've had Christmas in August. Tonight, we're having an emo party. <laughs> is that what emos do? No. I don't know, I don't know but we're, we're gonna listen to a lot of My Chemical Romance. A lot of people are gonna come over. Um, Veronica has blonde hair, and that just can't do. No. Emos got black hair, okay, so yeah. we're gonna, we're got some black hairspray and we're gonna see my hair and okay. hope that it comes out. This will be good. This is good. Wow, look at her turn from a blonde to a brunette in literally seconds. You look, look good. I've never seen you as a brunette. Well, yeah. Black haired black -haired. emo. <laughs> Just wait till the eyeliner's on. I know. So this is the prize that we found for the best costume. But well, we need to emo it up a little bit, I think. Hey guys, this is how you can do your own ratchet doll at home. So use some. Today we're gonna be using the Kat Von D <laughs> black <laughs> lipstick. And we're just gonna coat it on your doll's head. And take your same Kat Von D eyeliner <laughs> and just <this> mask it. <laughs> <laughs> in the holes where the <laughs> eyes once <laughs> were. Like, add that. If you want to just like add a little special detail, I'm gonna make it my own. Just give her like a bald spot in the back. Most pe people our age are putting diapers on their babies. We're doing this. <laughs> That's pretty good. That's a pretty good prize. What do you think? Make sure you I look like a voodoo doll from Hot Topic. <laughs> Thank you so much for saying that. That is such a compliment. So I'm just gonna give you a little OOTD. Um, starting from the beginning. I gotta make this a little bit bigger. I think it's getting a little, a little flat skis. Um, as you can see, I have some lip piercings. I got myself a septum. Can't go wrong with a nice bow. Then we go into the Slayer shirt, which I found at a thrift store today. And also this belt. I got some suspenders. I got this whole bodysuit, which is very difficult to go to the washroom in. Uh, and then going down, we got some ripped pants, more fishnet, and I have platform shoes. But I think it did all right. Maybe I need some more eyeliner, but overall, not a bad look. And we got Kayla. Kayla, this is your original Fall Out Boy t-shirt. Mm -hmm. And look at these piercings. Oh my goodness. And do a little spin, do a little spin. An iPod Nano in her pocket. I love it. Um, so yellow pants that are literally second skin. <laughs> like literally second skin. They're causing me anxiety because I'm losing circulation. The good. attention to detail. And then. You drew um, on your own Drew shoes. on my own canvas shoes. Oh my goodness. Yeah. That's amazing. Let's go. All right, do a little spin, do a little spin. There we go. Very great, 
great. going on with me comment down below tell me like the biggest thing that is going on in your life right now the thing that you are most excited about that's coming up um, anything like that just to boost my spirits because it is still winter here and I am falling into a deep pit of seasonal depression you know that episode of Broad City when um, Alana like can't handle the fact that it's um, winter and she just needs like constant light around her that is pretty much how I'm feeling right now. Just keep me in your thoughts and um, all of that, you know? <laughs> okay, I will talk to you guys later. I will talk to you guys next week, I promise. And I just don't, I take my promises very seriously. Um, and tell your mom I say hi, tell your mom I missed her, and I'll talk to you guys later. Also, don't forget to subscribe. Oh, and something else that I wanna tell you. Okay, so coming up in two weeks, if you live in the Edmonton area, I'm interviewing Chad Michael Murray on stage for an hour in front of like hundreds of people, and you can be one of those hundreds of people. Um, just by clicking the link down below, there is the link to buy tickets that you can come watch. It's gonna be really fun. We're gonna be talking about One Tree Hill, obviously. Um, a bunch of the new things that he's been working on, and uh, I really wanna ask him about working with Paris Hilton and House of Wax and things like that, and kissing Hilary Duff and Lindsay Lohan. There's a lot of questions I have prepared for Chad Michael Murray. So if you live in the area and you want to come watch, it's going to be a lot of fun and I can't wait. Um, also, don't forget to hit the little bell so you get notified when I do upload a video and I will talk to you guys later. Bye! Oh, yeah.